Mary Astor's Purple Diary, The Great American Sex Scandal of 1936, written by Edward Sorrell and drawn by Edward Sorrell. There are many, many drawings throughout the book that he has done. The, this, if you're a Hollywood buff, you will love this book. It's got, it's all about her love life and her marriages and uh, different people that she came into contact with, the studios, and and also the trial that she had to, she was taken to court by her husband. She had a lover and he was going to get even with her and try to take their child away. It is a very entertaining book and also the author, Edward Sorrell, um, he interjects his life in there too. So it, it's just a, a slice of Americana, very entertaining. I want to say something about graphic here because um, he, uh, Edward Sorrell, it describes himself and calls himself an illustrator, caricaturist, and cartoonist. Uh, with He does satires and pictorial essays, and they have appeared in Vanity Fair, Esquire, Atlantic Monthly, and The New Yorker, and it says more. Now, one of the words you will see popping up in the book world for maybe the last 10, I, I'm not sure how recently, is the term graphic. I shy away from it, and I would say graphic may have come into popularity, oh, after or the Harry Potter books, more with the younger generation. I shy away from it, and the reason being, the only time I really ever heard graphic was as a very young person in and in regards to pornography, because pornography would end up in the courts when I was young. How graphic is it? And there were, how do you measure what is pornography, what isn't pornography, but that term graphic would come up. So when I would see graphic in recent years in regards to books, I just, I just shied away from it. You know, I thought, oh, I know what that is. But recently, the library has a shelf and they labeled, labeled it graphic and I thought, oh, oh, oh I've got to look. Let's see. And I looked at a book or two, and I got it right away. It, it's very similar to fiction, um, adult uh, books with hand-drawn pictures. Like Some of them look a little like comic books, but only they're telling real fictional type stories. But that's what graphic is today. And uh, the use of the word, I'm sure, has a wide range of usage. But I, I just have to chuckle to myself when I finally force myself to look at a graphic book. But Edward Sorrell, he is very sophisticated in the work he does. It's, it's quality drawing. He, he will present uh, different points of view into one picture. It, it's a very, very entertaining read.